Hello, I'm Carl from CC Savers, and this is your um, 89 mall stuff and traces made by uh, Solo Savers. Um, so let's go through this first. It has a, a CCX Neo Pixel connector and a pumpkin profi board. It uses a, a protected. 18650 battery and the, to the bottom is negative, there is a spring and uh, on the top is a uh, positive and uh, at the bottom is a 28 millimeter base speaker and uh, this is the same one. Oh, and also two pixel accent here and double switch setup and it's fully removable. So let us see how to snug this chase into um, this hilt. So remove the pommel. And Jeremy told me that um, I need to send in both sides of the 28 millimeter speaker in order to fit the chase. So um, you might see there the sending marks here. So the switch to the top, so it will be like this in the hilt. And before you're doing this, uh, I'm not very sure if this happens also on your hilt, but on both of my hilt, you need to loosen this screw, loosen this up, in order to not uh, not let this and this and it actually this blocks away of the trace going into the hilt. And the bottom LED. Oops. Okay, losing it a little bit. I'm pretty much sure you need to loosen this one, but I'm not very sure about if these two on your hilt need to lose them, but yeah, just in case, I think losing it it's better. So here we go to the very top. Oh, and also the belt clip. Um, I have different situations on my two sabers. So on this one, the length of the a screw for the this belt clip is perfectly fine um, so the trace can smoothly go in and on my other one you need to cut a, a, a little just a little in order to make sure that this screw not blocks away when the trace go in so uh, if you find there is also this problem on your hilt and you can let me know I can help you to do that or you can simply use a drill mill to cut the thread uh, uh, to cut the screw a little bit and since it will not be seen so ugly is fine I think since I do mine a little ugly it's like a bit, uh, I but I send it to make it look nice so make these two holes align with the top holes. Screw these two retention screws here and make sure the screws here are tight. Okay, here you go. As you can see, the lights can shine through these two LEDs. And the pixel connector. Aux switch here. And I also enable the battle mode on uh, both of the chase. So you can rotate it, turn it off, or swing it hard to make it turn on. 
um, by the way, I personally very like this sound font uh, you sent me. Um, it just feel very powerful, you know, like it's a very beginning like this. Boom. Um, so this is pretty much about it. So uh, this trace system use um, two 28 millimeter speakers, but I found that um, even if I pull the volume all the way up to the 3000, um, the sound still become a little vague, I think, when you do the stuff. Since uh, the stuff will block the way that sound goes out, it only has a ring of little holes on the connector. But yeah. I think this is a common problem on this hilt. Um, uh, whatever you use, a, no matter you use a 28 or 22 millimeter speaker. So, but it sounds nice when you uh, only use a half of it, like use this decorate piece, and there is a sound vent sound holes in here the sound can come through nicely yeah so that's pretty much about it and uh, since the other one is the same I'll just show you uh, without the field And I leave enough wire slack under the sound ball, so don't worry about that you pull it up and the wire will um, broken or something. Just do it, and it will be fine. And just make sure that you um, just arrange the wire a little bit when you put the proby boards back. Yeah, and that's pretty much about it. Thank you. And here is a little demo with the um, blading. It uses a 7 8 blade, and I use a 60 millimeter. Oh, sorry, 60 cm actually. <laughs> 60 cm uh, shot blade here. It's the same as your um, the blade with your golden Yoda and that the child hilt. So I think two. 60 cm shot blade will do fine and if you use like a, a 32 or 36 it's way too long it will touch the roof or the floor so let's see oh and make sure that you insert the blade all the, all the way down to the neopix connector so since there's a lot of space from the emitter here to at the top of the neopixel connector. So make sure that you insert that all the way down. I just actually found these three sound phones that come from the same pack as Anze. <laughs> They're all very good. Yeah, so this is a little demo for the um, blade inserting. So I hope you like it. Thank you.